<laughs> Tell me about that cause that's very important for you, the kids. Well, I mean, when uh, when when you do, um, you know, open the foundations uh, or you do some, uh, you know, by helping kids, it's uh, one thing. But when you experience as you, your personal life, you experience something similar to that. And, you know, back then you nobody able to support you or help you somehow. And and now you you see those kids, what they're dealing with. And you kind of feel like you always put yourself in their position and feel like, you know what, why would they make those kids struggle instead of just kind of you know all all together you know help those kids and achieve their goals whatever they want to be you know it doesn't have to be you know athletes or you know, hockey players you know they can be designers can be anybody but the thing is they they have to be free to to do uh, whatever they like to do in their lives like we did the camps uh, this summer you know the kids afraid to show their scars but the way we did it is we we, uh, we brought um, 30 kids and they able to bring one of their friends normal uh, you know kids mm -hmm. and they they play together and they actually you know believe it or not they, they even forgot that they have a scars on them like they weren't afraid to show their scars they were just so happy actually to show their scars and <laughs> it was funny thing is one guy was crying that he didn't have a heart surgery he was crying just because he didn't have the scar on it and I was like, oh, I want to have the same scar. And I was like, <laughs> you didn't realize yeah, that idea, uh, it came with it. Yeah, but the, the idea was, um, you know, the, the kids, they, you know, they felt so comfortable. And because they watched their friends and they were able to do the same thing, what their friends do. And anyway, we had a, we had a one guy that uh, uh, he, have a, he, ha he has a uh, half a heart and you're not supposed to swim. But like there was probably half of the kids not supposed to swim, but they're like swimming hours and hours and like not even forgot about it. And I mean, how amazing is that? And, you know, they was, uh, they was so excited just leaving the camp and uh, they were just already like, want to you know, where is the next camp? And there was the next camp. So it's, that's, that's the idea. I mean, you just have to help the kids and to forget you know what they battle with that's how i battle my uh um you know problems because doctor said you can't play hockey anymore and now like oh like can i skate like no you're not allowed to skate maybe 20 minutes in a week uh and i how old know, were you when they told uh, you that? i was like eight nine years old and uh, and i uh, came back home i said you know what I, i'm just gonna do whatever it takes uh, sleep eat normal properly and but uh, um, i'm not gonna quit this is what i like to do i'm gonna try to forget my problems, just trying to take care of myself and, you know, eventually it's going to overcome.